Let's talk about mules. Now, they are a super popular shoe at the moment. Everybody's wearing them, but lots of people do make a lot of mistakes when styling them. Now, I'm just gonna be going over a few of them today and showing you definitely what not to do. But I would just like to preface it with that you can style them however you want. It's just, this is my personal opinion on how you should be wearing them and the way I think they look the best, but you can wear them however you want. Now, starting off, when I first got my first set of mules, I noticed that crop pants look really dumb with them. I don't really like the look it gives off. It looks just super awkward. Like, I don't know. It just, it really accentuates that you're wearing mules and not in a good way, I think. So yeah, basically, in my opinion, I think you should be wearing full length trousers that sort of cover the end of your heel. I think they look best. But if they slightly don't cover the end of your heel, I think that's still fine. Okay, now the next one I think is a cardinal sin for wearing mules not wearing socks. I think it just looks so weird and awkward. I don't like it. I think that you should always be wearing socks with mules, my opinion. If you've got open-toed sandals, then hey, get those toes out. But I think that if you're wearing a covered-in mule, don't wear no socks. Always wear socks. It's probably the better way to say it. Now, on the topic of socks, not wearing the correct style of sock or the right color for your outfit also looks really weird and awkward. I think that you should always be wearing full length socks with mules. Uh, don't be wearing ankle socks. That's, that's really weird. I don't think I've ever seen anyone do that, but I think it'd be a really weird look. Um, yeah, and also different colored socks. So if you've got like hot pink socks on with your tonal outfit, it just looked really weird. It might be what you want to look like, I don't know, but personally, I think it just stands out too much and it just looks really dumb. <laughs> now, I am kind of guilty of this, uh, not wearing the right size mules. So I got an EU 43 with my mules and usually I'm a 44, so it's only a portion smaller, but um, yeah, they are slightly too small. But yeah, if you wear bigger size mules for your feet, I think they look absolutely ridiculous. They're gonna be slipping and sliding off your foot everywhere and they're gonna look like clown shoes. I just don't think it's a good look for anyone wearing the wrong size shoe, but especially with mules, I think they just look super bad. Also wearing mules that are too small for you, uh, your heel is gonna get really uncomfortable and it's gonna look kind of weird too with your heel hanging off the end. Uh, but yeah, it would just, it would be really sore because you'd be right on the edge and your heel's just going to be digging into it, you know? Now, another thing that you should never, ever wear with mules is shorts. Now, I, I don't think I've seen people do this, uh, especially with socks. I just think it would look really weird. I don't think mules are made for shorts. I mean, I th I'm sure someone out there could probably style it and it would probably look good. Probably Daniel Simmons could do it. Or, or someone like that. But for me, I just can't picture a good scenario of wearing mules with shorts. I just think it looks really weird. I think if you're wearing shorts, wear open toe shoes with it or, or normal sneakers. Don't wear mules, please. God, please don't. <laughs> okay, so I was gonna do this as B-roll, but you have to see this. I have to talk you through it. Are you kidding me? Like. It looks ridiculous. I didn't think it was gonna look this dumb, but wait, stay there. It's way worse with socks. Way worse. Oh my god. Don't don't wear socks with shorts and mules. It's ridiculous. Don't do it. My god. If you need any more convincing than that, like, I honestly, I, I don't know what else I can tell you. Okay, so finally, the first thing that you probably should be doing with your slides or your mules is protecting them. So if you've got leather ones, obviously do leather care. But if you've got suede ones, put some suede protectant on it because there's nothing worse than looking at mules that are filthy and ratty and they just look like they've been worn out. I think... Just try and keep them nice and clean. Uh, and protect it will really help that. Uh, I've got a video out, a short, on how to protect your suede shoes. This works for all suede shoes, 
not just mules, but mine are specifically mules in that video. So yeah, if you want to check that out, I'll leave a link down in the description. Now with cleaning them, obviously leather, you can just wipe it right off or any other style of material that has been used. But with suede, obviously it's a little bit different and I will bring out a short showing you how to clean your suede. Now, if you've got a pair of mules and you might want to upgrade or get a different style, go check out this other video here where I compare Doc Martin Carlson's with Birkenstock Boston's. And I'll catch you next week with another video.